the Mass Effect soundtrack. Did you, um... Did you get the... No, you should get it. It's a digital download. Yeah, but... It, it, did it come with the entire Mass Effect thing, or is it just Mass Effect 3s? I don't know. I gotta say, I think it's just Mass Effect 3s. Yeah, I don't want Mass Effect 3s. Updated, we have the required spatial bindings. Meet you back here. No, yeah, let's see what music they're playing. Ah, uh, piano. I'd be worried. That's boring. I just wanted to check in on you. See how you're doing. Why are we mourning over I Ashley? I don't know. She was such a dick on friggin' Horizon, and now we're like, boo-hoo. I don't even think I showed this much emotion when Caden died. Yeah, I mean, he didn't have a relationship with us. So no. Why do you care? Like, if she was the romance interest, I think I'd understand. I would yeah. be okay with that. But she's not. So I didn't even like her. And she's not even dead. So why am I even sad? No, no, right. Uh. This stream, is this stream working again? Because mine's not. Yeah, it up. is. It's fine? Okay. I can't, yeah, believe the, just... I can't believe the bad option is you'll be fine. <laughs> It's probably not bad. It's just a flesh wound. You hang in there, all right? I need you up and reporting for duty ASAP. You hear me, soldier? You need really? anything. Done. Let me know. No, no, this is not okay, Mass Effect 3 I'm playing. You take care. This sounds this sounds like the piano th song from Gears of War 3. You know the commercial in Gears of War? I'll see you soon. No, but there's a really famous commercial yeah. when they first showed Gears of War where all these all the soldiers were dying and they were playing a really sad piano piece in the background. <sighs> and I was kinda like, well, you know, it was it was pretty good. It was poignant because, you know, they were at the end of a losing war. But I don't care about Ashley. She's not even dead. What is the menu theme? That's what I wanna know. Okay, if you can find the name of the menu theme, just tell me and I'll yeah. put it up. Because I have I know the names. All right, back to good music. Watch, I'm see. You know how you and I are voicing like legitimate, well, like things we're noticing about the game that we don't like. We're gonna be voicing this, and there's gonna be people on YouTube who are like, "No, no, everything about this game is perfect," even though you and I are both pretty big Mass Effect fans. They're gonna be like, no, also, you, you guys hate this game. Also, Anastasia yeah. would like to voice his belief that Ashley should remain in the hospital the entire game. Oh, hey, that's pretty good. I'm with that. Maybe that's an option. That is an option, right? No. Sigh. Not the romance theme. Welcome, Commander Shepard. Please, so one moment. How am I disgraced? I mean, I was walking on the Citadel when I was working for Cerberus, no one cared. Wait a minute, Altair? Is that you? Oh no, it's just a Solarian. So if I'm hearing correctly, so Reapers are attacking all the planets, like main planets? Yes? Maybe? I don't know. I don't know. 
There is no anti-humanity conspiracy here, Ms. Al Jalani. The council's simply not granting interviews at this time. Oh, this person. My viewers are going to know that CSEC and the council are denying them access. Listen, lady, you think I like playing gatekeeper between the paparazzi and the Apparently, politicians? I don't, I don't know have if time it's to right or not. Them, and I'm it's not here to hold your hand. Well, I'm Vigil. hanging out until I'm granted an audience. Vigil, all right. Fine. I know that one. I hope you brought a sleeping bag. I think. Commander Shepard? Commander Humanity has questions. Damn press. I see you're keeping the oh peace. Oh god, it's the reporter. Yeah. Uh, I don't give me the option of punch her in the face. Man. Really? Yeah. Would see it as well, this rock. game is ruined. She yeah, doesn't even mention that I punched her in the face. I'd rather be back down she didn't the mention it the first time. I appreciate the higher pay grade, but I'm not a political creature. Don't lose your edge. You might need it. I oh, wouldn't mind an excuse to get my fingers dirty. <laughs> it's killing me about Earth. You and me both. Yeah. I haven't been back in years. Just gonna no, stand never, here and talk. If this ain't the end of days, it's pretty damn close. The core planet's being attacked. Whatever. Alright. It's called, um, Vigil, I believe? Yes. Alright. Let's load that up. Oh, this music. God, I love this theme. Oh, this is the song that played on, um, Ilos. When you're talking to the Prothean... When you're talking to Vigil. Yeah. Well, I couldn't remember what his name Commander. was. Oh, I couldn't either. Said you'd be coming. It's, it's in if the main menu the of, of Mass Effect 1. We've got our own problems, Counselor. Earth is not in this alone. But Earth was the first Council world hit. By all reports, it faces the brunt of the attack. By your reports. Wow, this music actually matches pretty well. Yeah, it does. I have good taste. Yeah, the reports are good active. timing too. Earth was attacked by the Reapers. And it's just the beginning. We need your help. Everything you could spare. Each of us faces a similar situation. Even now, the Reapers are pressing on our Reapers? Borders. No, no, no. It's the Geth. <laughs> will fall. We must fight this enemy together. And so we should just follow you to Earth? Even if we were to unite our fleets, do you really believe we could defeat the Reapers? I don't expect you to follow me without a plan. Counselors. We have that plan, a blueprint, created by the Protheans during their war with the Reapers. A blueprint for what? We're still piecing it together. Yeah, I wouldn't have mentioned that right now, Liara. a weapon of some sort. Capable of destroying the Reapers? So it would seem. The scales. It would some be a shadow broker you are. No, she's not no. a shadow broker in this one. I forwarded the plans to Admiral Hag. What? I didn't finish the Shadow Broker mission with my Paragon Shepard. All right. Because I want to see if it was different. It'd be interesting if she's all secretive. If we yeah, it would be. Have you considered that the Reapers destroyed the Protheans? I have a feeling it's not. It was incomplete. There was a missing component here. Something referred to only as the Catalyst. Oh, but Gore they ran out of time before they could finish building it. Do you really believe this can stop the Reapers? So we have the we conduit. Can work. And so do I. Now we have the catalyst. And while I haven't always agreed with Adina, he's right about this. We need to stand together. Now more than ever. The Reapers won't stop at Earth. They'll destroy every organic being in the galaxy if we don't find a way to stop them. The cruel and unfortunate truth is that while the Reapers focus on Earth, we can prepare and regroup. We are convening a summit amongst our species. If we can manage to secure our own borders, we may once again consider aiding. I'm sorry, Commander. That is the best we can do. Shepard, meet me in my office. The best we can do is <sighs> nothing, as <sighs> always. Yeah, I was about to say, the Council hasn't done anything. 
They've done one thing, and that's make me a specter. They're a bunch of self-concerned jackasses, Shepard. Wait a minute, Udina, why are you a counselor now? I made Anderson a counselor. A company, yeah, in the books, Anderson's a, like, rape. now I can't handle being a counselor How can they be anymore. So, blind? so they just railroaded us, essentially. They're yep. scared, and they're looking out for themselves. Our people are scared, and we are looking out for them the best we know how. Counselor. And I haven't read the books, I just heard Commander, that that's what happened. I can't give you what you need, but I can tell you how to get it. I'm listening. Primarch Vidorian called the war summit, but we lost contact with whoa, him. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down. The Turian Counselor is being helpful? Yeah. What? I don't the know. Ships that can extract Primarch Vidorian undetected. So far, you've only explained how I can help you. It might seem that way. But the leaders of this summit will be the ones deciding our future, the fate of our fleets, where they fight, and with whom. A grateful Primarch would be a tremendous ally in your bid to unite us. We're at war. And you want me to play politician? If it gets you what you need, what does it matter? <sighs> our latest intelligence says that the Primarch was moved to a base on Palavan's largest moon. I've done all I can to help. The rest is up to you. See, I can sort of hear some background music, but it feels like it should be more prominent. Maybe I turn it down too much. Down. The council wanted me to tell you, we've chosen to uphold your Spectre status. Oh, gee, thanks. And various resources will be made available to you. How would you give me, like, a whole fleet? Well, that went well. It's a start. I'll talk to the others in the meantime. See if we can support this You can have free guns when you have the appropriate thanks. training. You can have free fun, uh, guns, provided you give us an equivalent amount in credits. We don't let everyone have this <laughs> ability, but you're a Spectre Shepherd. So yeah, check, check your Yeah, sound. I'll check my sound. I turned it a little bit down because it's hard to hear the noise. It's only 88%. Yeah, even turning it higher doesn't really change too much. Oh well. You know what might end up happening? <laughs> if this continues, I might just load the Mass Effect 3 soundtrack in my Winamp, and then I'll just play it, and it'll be louder. And wait, wait. I saw options there for voice commands. Really? Yeah. Voice mode. Oh no, that's push to talk. Yeah. Force voice chat. Voice. This is all voice chat. Yeah. Okay, so maybe it's chat. a maybe it's a like option here, like a gameplay option. Hence, it, mu it must know. just be for multiplayer. It might just. It might Never just. Mind. Well, you know, it has connect, right? Like connect commands. So maybe yeah, they kept that, right? Yeah, But lame that we can't do it. We should. I mean, we've had mics for years. That's what I don't understand. Oh well. Stupid game, hate you so much. It kind of sounds like the Novaria soundtrack in the background. So, maybe I can talk to each of the diplomats and get a quest? No, I have a feeling that it's going to be a linear progression. Oh, gore ram it. Nisha shall me Cyan. Enter shooting range. Yeah, I got time for that. I estimate only a hundred thousand people are dying every hour. Oh yeah, I forgot this gun sucks. <laughs> How do I change my gun? It doesn't suck, it just it excels in different ways. That's exactly it. Alright, let's try this again. See, the one you're picking has much lower accuracy. Really? This one has, like, zero recoil, so it lets me hit everything in the center. Yeah. Hmm. What's good for against armor? Is that five? Fire. Oh, So 
what's the point of this? Um, to practice, but you picked ice. Why are you using ice against? Am I am I gonna get like a heart container for this? Well, that was dumb. Is it choppy? Is it choppy on the stream, guys? No. I'm not sure why mine isn't loading. There we oh, go. wait, it is now. It is choppy. Okay. Well. I'm going back to the wards. Actually, you know what's a good one for this? Yes! Is that in game or did you pick that? I picked that. Okay. Alright, is the stream better? Yeah. Yeah, tell me if it gets laggy or if the sound starts like getting jittery. Ooh, this chick. Alright. Yay, town puncher in the face. Commander Shepard, Kalisa been seen in Al Jalani. Isn't it true that you were on Earth when the Reapers attacked? How do you justify running away while millions of people on Earth die? Is that the best we can expect? I've had enough of your tabloid journalism. Not this time, you military. <laughs> I. Oh! Wait, did I kill her? Whoops. I get you. But I came here to get help for Earth, not answer your questions. Stay down. I think she's You're dead! Alive. I think she's dead, man! You killed her! You killed her in front of like, the camera! She's not moving! <laughs> I'm Commander Shepard. Oh shit! I hate reporters. I'm Commander Shepard, and I approve this message. Oh man! Wow! I knew we'd go too far one day. I knew I was gonna snap. Uh, I guess you talk to James. Hey, Commander. Liara told me the Council's not interested in helping us. Something like and that. And I thought Jacob was planned. Why would they? Look at this place. There's no war here. People are whispering about it. They're talking about it. But they don't really believe it. I can hardly believe it myself. Like everything back on Earth is some kind of nightmare. Yeah. That's what I hate most. It's like this place wants you to forget that. So, you still want to go back to Earth? Hell yeah. But, you were right. So was Anderson. We can't stop them alone. Besides, looks like you're gonna have your hands full convincing these pendejo politicians to help us. And I'm up for it. Whatever it takes. Glad to hear. I'm gonna head down to some of the lower levels where they keep it real. You got some spare time? You should come and find me. How do I give you an order to go back to the Normandy right now? Sheesh, what are we running? I, I don't get it. Earth is actually actively under attack right now, and everyone is just standing around like... Whatever. It's kind of breaking my willing suspension of disbelief here. All right, whatever. Let's go load, load up. Get my characters. Save Earth. Save the Earth. Control what? The ship yet. what in Sam hell is this? Are we having dream sequences now? I don't even know what's going oh on. Oh my goodness, really? You know, originally I was like joking about some of this, but there's actually like a lot of things I'm beginning to not like about this game. Yeah. 
It's it's stacking up. It is. He's gonna feel bad that that one kid didn't make it. Which makes no sense. Is this your, your son? in the past hey that would be something isn't it that's actually like yourself that was yourself as a kid coming to the future and you saw yourself die so now you have to save yourself and issue the rest of earth yeah and then like slowly like as the longer you take you start like seeing back to the future style where like your hands just start slowly disappearing because you're taking too long <laughs> that's how I'm justifying this now happened, I would be so happy. I would. We have to come up with so many justifications in this game. I know. This... Oh no, I'm tortured because one little boy died. We don't care about the other people on that shuttle, just that one little boy. Yeah, let's not forget all the parents you murdered, like, throughout your entire military career. Oh my you goodness. Uh, if the plot is following arrival, you wiped out 300,000 Batarians. Liara, can I help you? I've been forwarding the Turian. Watch, they're going to force you to romance Liara now. It can't be built without council support, but he's not budging until their Primarch is safe. I know. Are you alright? I saw myself from the past, but he was in the future. But he died, and now I have to go save myself, and and from from being on fire. I hope you, I hope you understand this. I didn't get what you'd call a good night's rest. There's more to it than that, isn't there? What's really bothering you? When the Reapers hit, embrace eternity. I could hear people screaming in the streets below me. We left a lot of them behind. Of course, we left them behind. There's no way for you to save them all. But I know you're doing everything you can, and you'll get back there in time to help. I hope you're right. Don't blame yourself, Commander. I'm not. The game's forced me to Bob blame Shepard? myself. I'm Specialist... Oh. Uh, I, I beg your pardon. I thought you were alone. I was just leaving. Are you the new Yao Man? Where's Yao Man William? A love letter. Com specialist Samantha the trainer with Alliance R and D. Was she really? I was part of the team retrofitting the Normandy after you turned it over to the Alliance. I didn't turn it over. The game railroaded me to give it to the Alliance. There weren't many of us aboard when the Reapers hit. I'm going to be indifferent to you. I need the Normandy functional. What exactly have you done to my ship? We upgraded communications and removed most of the Cerberus tech. Come on. <laughs> but kept the AI for some reason. Meaning? <laughs> the ship's the in evil line AI that took over yeah. the ship. It has new, top of the line, quantum entanglement communicators. In fact, Admiral Anderson had intended to use the Normandy as his mobile command center. That's no longer an option. Yes, I heard he chose to stay and fight. I in any event, I'm honored to serve under you, Commander. For as long as you need me, that is. They only sent me here to oversee the retrofits. Shepard. Some of our systems require further testing, and Specialist Trainer has been extremely effective during installation. I would prefer that she remain. Got it, Edie. Oh, wait, since when does a virtual intelligence make requests? Edie's an AI. Fully self-aware. Oh, I didn't know she's an AI. Oh, I knew it. I knew VI. Was oh, okay. AI, right, yeah, yeah. fully self-aware. I got that. I to be a simple VI to protect myself. Okay, that makes sense. If I she's... Okay, that's good. Deception. Thanks, E.D., and I apologize for all those times I talked about how mm, attractive your voice was. Focus, you anyway, morons. People I are dying. I think you'll be impressed by the new upgrades. In the CIC, you'll find the galaxy map where you can set the Normandy's destination. Yep, I'm a commander. I know you that also already. check your messages at your private terminal. Yep, already got that. The war room houses a strategic command center for mission-specific intel and war analysis. The shuttle bay contains an armory where you can modify your equipment between missions. 
Finally, Liara has set up a lot of hardware down in the old XO office on deck three. I think she's cleaned that room. Finally, the first, the yeah, first good we upgrade. Before, we have purged this entire here. ship Thank of Miranda's influence. Admiral Hackett would like to speak to you at the <laughs> Oh, come on, let me at least walk down to talk to him. Udina updated me on your meeting with the yeah. council. Yeah. Sounds like they're running scared. Jeez, a mice. The council has been a pain in my ass from day one. I'm done with them. Then what's your plan? I'm trying to get the Turian Primarch for a summit meeting with the Asari and Salarians. I'll bypass the council and appeal directly to their leadership. That's good, I like it. This is where we start laying the groundwork for our counterattack. Unfortunately, we don't have a whole lot to back it up right now. Then build alliances. Gather everything and everybody you can for the cause. What about the Prothean device? Find me people who can help build it. And if you can't, I'll take ships, soldiers, supplies, whatever you can get. We need to keep hitting the Reapers across every theater of war they open. Buy us time to figure out the device. And when it's finished? Assuming it ever is, we pool all our resources. Think of it as a giant armada for delivering the device when the Reapers are most vulnerable. Oh my goodness. Talk to Commander armada, Shepard. Don't talk stupid to the person playing the game. He knows what an armada is. What about Earth, sir? We'll just have to hope Anderson and what's left of the Alliance forces can hold out until we've dealt with the enemy. I understand. Good. Then make it happen, Commander. I'll be expecting regular updates on your progress. Hack it out. Okay, so you know how his face is artifacting, like when he's talking? Yeah. Is that is that part of the game or is that because my computer can't handle like the the graphics? I don't know. Cause I don't where is Hackett that he can't seem to talk to me? Like, I'm, I don't know, I must be missing something. It doesn't feel like... It, see, this is what pisses me off. Friggin' Alliance abandoned me two years ago when I was dying. And did die. And then servers rebuilt me, and they're, they're, they're still like, oh, screw you. And stuff. And then I come back, and they're all charging me with murder, and then they want me to save them again. And not even a single thank you. Well, to be fair, an arrival hack it to like, yeah, thanks. You're, you're awesome, Shepard. Lies. What the heck is this? War terminal. Okay, well this is nice. Alright. The people, weapons, armies, and fleets that you've accumulated are all your war assets. The overall readiness of the galaxy determines how effectively these assets perform the final battle. Okay, yeah, this is what I want to talk about. It, yeah, so it feels like I know what they're doing, very similar to Mass Effect 2. Or the whole game you're building up for this final thing, right? Mm -hmm. But I don't know. It feels a little contrived because if like Earth, if they were like coming towards Earth, or they had gotten news of that, and you're ready, getting like preparing things to fight it, then I'd understand. But Earth is really under attack. It's not like Mass Effect Two where you're chasing the collectors and you had all day to like, you know, go through the Omega Four relay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Anyway, this is cool. I do like this. This is where multiplayer can factor into it. Oh, I see. Man, so it's so tempting. I should just I should play this Shepherd to get like a hundred percent, and I should play Renegade Shepherd just to get to minimum and see what happens. <laughs> she was always the reckless one, and she would care more about just doing it as fast as possible. Okay, so what is this? So they gutted the ship and made it look ugly. Hey, I remember that table. Friggin' Alliance. Yeah, that was the table in the conference room. Yeah, it, it, that so sucks because the Normandy SR2 is such a sleek, beautiful ship. Yeah. And it's like, no, we're going to pull it apart and make sure that Severus didn't hide a bomb on her at all. Or something like that. The Alliance has found a new Cerberus lab on Sanctum. Admiral Hackett would like you to investigate. Um, so so where's Yao Man? I should get Yao Man back here. 
Well, that's the thing. You you got to find her. I don't ah, think she's so on they the just they just ripped out all the doors, and half the lighting doesn't work anymore. Who thought this was a good idea? Alliance. See, this is why I hate working with Alliance. They just do everything, and then like you're screwed. And then Cerberus was giving you a clean ship. I would have worked with it, Relusive Man. Yeah, hey, but Cerberus is the council. arbitrary villain. After years of ignoring your warnings, they're finally willing to step up and tell you they just can't help. Joker, why are you happy about this? You hated the you hated the council. In fact, why are you even he's, here? He's 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 being sarcastic. They're doing everything they can. No, why is he even here? Please validate our parking. Oh. Okay. Um, let me know if you want me because to he's always worked for the alliance. You know, for have, time's sake. have you been indoctrinated too, Joker? <laughs> Joker, hang on, buddy. I'm gonna save you. <laughs> 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 oh, Goramit! Look at this place. Such a mess. Look what they did to my ship. I know. Maybe that there'll that be hurt. maybe there'll be a mini game where I slowly make the ship pretty again. I hope so. Like, as you slowly gather resources, just the ship becomes nicer. Cerberus has attacked Eden Prime and now is occupying the colony. Alliance sources are stretched, stretched too thin and attempt to liberate the colony. Oh my goodness. Now, what do they Fre mean by priority mission? As in, like, oh no, you failed this. <laughs> it's like, no, no, we don't, don't worry about Earth, okay? We're, we've got new planets now. Earth was getting kind of old. While we're in dry dock, Joker suggested a small welcoming gift that'd be appropriate to have on hand. You should be reinstated as commanding officer. Ship does not have the capacity of comic dangers. Blah 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 blah. Yay! I get a hooded jacket. Yeah. Thanks, Thanks Edie. That's your collector's edition. Yeah, I know. Oh, and you get a dog. That's right. I like that it's not that you get a dog, it's that you've kidnapped someone else's dog. Is it really? Something like that, I think. Oh, I'm taking care of someone's dog. Oh, Whoever because this... they left it there. Who is this Andrea Brown? That's a code someone name. Someone who was working on the ship. That's a code name for friggin' uh, Miranda. Blow the dog yep. out of the airlock! <laughs> it's a spy dog! That's an order, Lieutenant! Oh boy, well, I guess this is the only way, okay, until the game starts getting real good. This is the only way we can do it. Let's see what they changed to my cabin. Okay, wait, you know what? You know what? Screw Not this. a lot. We need, we need proper music for this, since they seem to rob me of everything. Where is that one I like? Why does EA hate you? Where the heck is that? Well, pick the Normandy. No, there's one I always had for the captain's, um... Oh, really? Nice. Like, you know how you could you could pick, like, the captain's mix kind of thing? Yeah. And there was always one song in there that I always played, but I can't remember what it was called. Presumably I think it's this one. I think it's Criminal Elements. I think it's this one. Is it? Yeah, it's this one. Well, they gave me another shelf for my ships. I guess that was a priority. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> they put duct tape on my walls. Did they? Yeah. Oh my god. Like, is. Is there even a hull? Is there is even a hull still installed, guys? No. It's is this just fabric? Is this just like. Yeah, they just put a tarp over everything. And then was like, okay, it's good. Just sew it up. Gosh. You should use some of those bits of armor that you got. Hey, I have that hoodie. That's pretty awesome. But you it doesn't. Do? I do. I have that hoodie. I'm wearing it right now, actually. Really? Yeah. You have a hoodie. I have, I have an N7 hoodie. It's. Pretty you much are exactly that. Such a nerd. Yeah.
Yeah, none of those look like really casual though. It looks too casual. Well, no, that's the thing. You're such a nerd, and yet I hate you because I don't have one. <laughs> you get one. Okay, is this stream really lagging? No. It's fine. What? Yeah. Huh? That's weird. It's like really lagging on my end. All right. Chest. Spoilers, Anastasia. Shoulders. Does it tell you what the castle fabricated? Oh yeah, show info. Okay. what the Kessa one did. I, the armor looks ugly, so I'm not gonna wear it. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Oh, you can't go in the women's bathroom anymore? What? Wait, what is this? The, the gender segregation. Oh, this must be like a memorial. Exo Presley! Wait, his first oh, name was Charles? Wow. All those times he looked after the ship, I probably should ask him what his first name was. Yeah. I forgot he was dead. Okay. Well, as long as the stream is working for you, then I will pause my stream. Oh, no. no, okay, you paused it. Yeah. Just let me know if it starts lagging again, because for some reason it's lagging for me. So, do they explain what happened to all my team members, or I'm gonna just find that out? Uh, you're probably gonna find that out over time. Man, this is why I hate the Alliance. They take everything that's good and they wreck all those around them. I should just buy yeah. the MP3s off of Amazon right now. For what? For Mass Effect soundtrack. Let's see what the what music I got here. Oh, you got a Destiny Ascension model. Nice. Yeah. Probably because I saved him. Oh, yeah. And for some reason, they decided just to wall up all the windows for no good reason. You're not allowed to see the beautiful void of space. No, this harsh is, metal. This is the Alliance ship now. You can't have, have you lollygagging around looking out windows. You have one designated viewing window, which you are allowed to use 20 minutes a day. <laughs> oh boy, well... Maybe it would be better once I get some crew members in here. Dr. Shockwood should still be here, right? I mean... Sure, she defected back to the Alliance. No. And then it's like, nope, she's on Earth and dead. How about Legion? Wait. What's this thing still doing on the ship? Blow it out of the airlock. Along with the dog. All right. Apparently, well, no, oh, I can walk down here now, right by the laser batteries. They probably ripped out my really fancy uh, cannon and put in some garbage. Totally. All right. What is this about a hamster? Where do I get this hamster? Well, did you have a hamster in Mass Effect 2? No. Well, then you can't get the hamster. Oh, okay. Alright. That I know of. This is the only room that has improved. What is that room? Because it is awesome. This used to be Miranda's lame desk room. Is this room. Liara's room? This is now Liara's room. Sweet. Yeah. Oh, she's still got the BI. Huh. 
What are you? I'm Glyph, a VI assistant to Dr. Tassoni. I help her sort and Wait, wasn't this the thing data. from the Lair of the Shadow yeah. Broker? Obviously she got it working. Blah, Remember, you didn't do Lair didn't, of the Shadow Broker yeah. with this guy, so you don't know what it is. Packages. If you find any useful data, so we're just assuming that Liara did it on herself? And what should I Obviously. be looking for? <laughs> I'll inform you if you found relevant data. When you do, return to this terminal for your choices. In the meantime, Dr. Tassoni I will tell you when you. I get to this point Have a if pleasant day. it changes. If yeah. Like, oh, look, it's you. It looks like Liara got you working. It was less than ideal. At least <gasps> the council can't deny that my package? exist. I will get you. But I'm not sure how much comfort that is while they bicker over which portion of the galaxy to save. Yeah, they're just assuming she's a information I'm broker. I think. Liara? What is all this stuff? After you left for Earth, I had the chance to track down the information trader who'd kidnapped my friend. It wasn't easy, but I found the Shadow Broker and took over his information network. You're running that from the Normandy? What I can. Not all of the old broker's networks remained intact, but I have agents. So you took over as the galaxy's most famous information trader? Notorious might be a better term. At least it means I can help research this Prothean device. So she's still the shadow broker, right? Yep. Only this. Only I didn't help her do it. To use until we understand so she didn't really need my help at all. In fact, if I play this as a female shepherd who did help her, she probably won't even mention it. Did the Protheans actually complete this weapon? You mean, will it work? They wouldn't have poured their last resources into this device if they thought otherwise. But we really need to find out just Blue what kind of weapon edition. they left us. Nice. Is it any different? Or you still get the fabric patch and stuff? Yeah, it'd be nice to know we're not well, kids playing around with a loaded box. gun. Absolutely. Um, the damage it, it has a metal box and then it has like another cardboard People thing. Were yeah, starting that's to what it looks like. Okay, yeah. Came. If we I had think. a little more time, maybe Earth wouldn't. Uh, this I'm sorry. Metal. I understand Wait, if you don't as want in to the game box it. is metal? The game box is metal. And then you've got... And then you got like a little... You got like a cardboard yeah. container thing yeah. with the art book. Okay, yeah. The thought means a lot, Yeah. Thanks. And I have a code. And since I didn't mention it before. For a squad appearance back, pack and an N7 Arsenal pack. Neat. Wait a minute! I didn't get that code. Should have. Yeah. Or is that? Did that get downloaded automatically? So you didn't have a code? I have a code to activate. Um. Oh, it says when you install your Mass Effect 3 collection edition, your bonus content will be automatically downloaded and installed through Origin. Okay. Well, what does your code say? My code is for the um, from Ashes part. So it says activate your collector's edition content. So the only thing my code activates is the from Ashes. Everything else was automatically downloaded. Oh, whoops! I wasn't even paying attention to Liara. Um, good job, Liara. Keep information brokering. Well, that's going to get annoying if everyone on this ship is telling me when I have private messages. Woo, Velcro patch. This ship needs tally. It's not the same. Watch, I'm going to go to the bottom floor. I'm going to find Jack still there. She's been hiding this whole time. Nope. Not even. And she's still oh. angry with you. There's a pallet here. Why are all my models around here? It's like they, t it's like they took all my models and then they just put it in these boxes because they're like, where are these things? How dare you have a hobby, Cerberus trader? Well, I guess the ship still looks intact. Oh, I can go to number five. Weapons bench, all right. And 
then there's my from Ashes code. Hmm, the only thing I can modify is my shotgun for now. Yeah, the from Ashes code might take a bit. I don't see this hamster, guys. I don't think I have a hamster. Commander. All right. Well, we can't save them all. Time to use a galaxy map. Finally. Clusters already conquered by the Reapers can be accessed using the Normandy Stealth Drive. Search these clusters for survivors, salvage, and intel. Okay, that's cool. I'll, I'll give them that. That's cool. I'm glad they actually are showing me the effects of the Reapers. Yeah. That's no, cool. Like you like yeah. Wait a minute. Local cluster. How come local cluster is not on here? Shouldn't it be around here? The Normandy is equipped with a new and improved scanning pulse that can detect interests of objects, uses to uncover war assets, artifacts, intels, and fuel as you fly around the system. Be aware, however, each time the pulse that I use, the chance the Reapers will enter the system to rescue is increased. If a Reaper enters the system you're in, flee and wait until you have completed a mission before returning. Interesting. Hey, wait a minute, that's Palavin. This yeah. is the this is the Turian home planet. Yeah. Why can't I strip mine it? Because they took that out of the game. Lame. Oh, I can't mine anymore? Nope, now you just scan systems. Wow, then why even have different why even have me have different things here? Okay, I see, so I got a flavor. Oh, there's something here. Oh, no, that's not it. I don't know if there's actually anything in the system. That's strange. Let's fly out and see if there's anything there. Something. Wreckage. The wreckage of fuel depot destroyed any force fuel can be salvaged recovered fuel that I don't need. Well Oh no, I can still mine for things. Yeah, oh wait, no, no, this is a... Yeah. Oh no, this is just finding a location. Yeah. Look at that, look how huge that dot is. Remember in Mass Effect 2 it was so small? <laughs> now it's like, yeah. go here! Uh, I, I, I'm bitching about this game, guys. I'm, I'm still kind of enjoying it. Although there are certain... Now that I can fly around my ship, yes. What? Ah, oh, you got a banner, which will presumably unite all the Citadel races in happiness. That's exactly it.
That's a shame. I liked going to different planets and like, feeling that there was something on each planet. Now it just feels kind of empty. Maybe that'll change. Who knows? Mene, blah 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 blah. Reaper's plan for bombarding bases and fears resistance. Turian fleet. Uh, Turians have the advantage on the moon, but the Reapers have the patience to like, grind them down. Let every base capture Reapers. Then a Turian fleet, another place to repair refuel. I like how there's classified information. That's nice. It is the Turians after all. Huh. Do I not get that many team members? Haha! <laughs> oh, that mask makes him look like the Lone Ranger. So is there a wait for the... for the your team members? I guess not, maybe? Hmm. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh no. No. Palavin. We have an old friend there. Holy hell. They're getting decimated. Strongest military in the galaxy and the Reapers are obliterating it. Was it like this on Earth? Yes. Shepard. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Commander, the LZ's getting swarmed. James, open that hatch. You know, I was about to say I thought the first place they'd attack is... Um... The Citadel? And then I remember that. The Citadel, wow. Because the last place a Reaper got killed, so... Why are they human reapers? I mean, human husks. This is a Turian home like planet. They should be Turians. Ah, <laughs> whatever. Let's play the game, I guess.
Level 8 repair. Tabestic, get your men up on that north barricade. Yes, sir. Sergeant Bardas, find a way to get that comm tower operational. Sir. General. Commander Shepard, heard you were coming, but I didn't believe it. General Corinthus. I've come to get Primark Fedori. Primark Fedorian is dead. His shuttle was shot down an hour ago as it tried to leave the moon. That's gonna complicate things. How bad is it, General? We just lost about 400 men in half an hour. We set up camps on this moon as an advanced position to flank the enemy. A sound strategy. Just... Irrelevant. Exactly. The sheer force of the Reapers seems to make them immune to that sort of tactic. The Primarch and his men found that out the hard way. I'm sorry. I hear he was a good man. And a friend. He would have been an outstanding diplomat. So what happens now? The Turian hierarchy provides very clear lines of succession. Right. General Corinthus? With such heavy casualties, it's hard for me to be certain who the next Primarch is. Palavan Command will know. However, at the moment, Contacting them is is, is Primark the like the out. top Tyrion? Husks are swarming that area. We can't get close enough. Are to one of the top Tyrions? Don't worry, General. I'll get your tower operational. Thank you, Commander. Zoom Primark I'll take care of things like on this end. Leader. All right, let's go. So he's like the president. Yeah, he's the president. Tower, to the left of the main barricade in front of Palavin. Let's go. How do we get out of here? What? while but I'll do my best. Here they come. Ready, Liara? You bet. Let's take these monsters. You know, you should be able to kill those things a lot faster, like, more than one if you go through several of them. Wow, look at how look at how neatly this guy died. Help your men till I hear from you. Understood. Fair enough. Yeah. 
Shepard up. What the frick? What was that? You know, this is a thin moon. Shouldn't they have helmets on? Yeah. They're probably all using biotics. Yep. Even my, even my shepherd. What have you got? As your partner said, succession is usually simple. But right now, the hierarchy's in chaos. So many dead are MIA. I need someone. I don't care who. As long as they can get us the Turian resources we need. I'm on it, Shepard. We'll find you the Primarch. Isn't that Garrus? Garrus? Vicarian, sir. I didn't see you arrive. At ease, General. Good to see you again. I thought you'd be on Palavin. If we lose this moon, we lose Palavin. I'm the closest damn thing we have to an expert on Reaper forces, so I'm... advising. James. This is Garrus Vicarian. He helped me stop the Collectors. He's a hell of a soldier. Lieutenant, good to see you too, Liara. Good to see you in one piece, Garrus. General Corinthus filled me in. We know who we're after. Palavan Command tells me that the next Primarch is General Adrian Victus. Victus? His name's crossed my desk. Know him, Garrus? I was fighting alongside him this morning. Lifelong military. Gets results. Popular with his troops. Not so popular with military command. Has a reputation for playing loose with accepted strategy. You think he can get the job done? We both know conventional strategy won't beat the Reapers. Right now, he could be our best shot. And I trust him. Okay. Let's get him on the shuttle and get out of here. Commander! Shepard, come in! Can this wait, Joker? We're in the middle of a war zone. We've got a situation on the Normandy, Commander. It's like she's possessed. Shutting down systems, powering up weapons. I can't find the source. I need the Normandy standing by. We may have to bug out. Should I go back and take a look? Do it. What? Yeah. No. You I want to send that other dude back. But... Yeah, but we got separated. He went to bolster a flank that was breaking. Could be anywhere out there. We're trying to raise him, Commander. Incoming Harvester! Headed for the airfield! Oh, that's new. It must be a giant yeah, protein. Tell Primarch Victus will rendezvous here. In the meantime, let's go take care of whatever that thing dropped off. Coming, Garrus? Are you kidding? I'm right behind you. I'm not sure, it's kind of weird. It seems to think it's going to take six to seven hours. Wait, what? Are you sure you're not downloading it? It says, copying from disk. But then it's also got kilobytes a second. There we go, that's where the Turian kind of Reaper things are.
Oh crap. Why is there no place to hide here? Yeah, it's not as, um, I don't know, not as climatic as when he was like Archangel, right? He just kind of walks up and is like, Garrus, but whatever, you know. I, for a second I thought he was going to be the Palvin guy. Brace yourselves as Shepard pulls off. He has a lot of armor. Yeah, but I think it's all armor. Oh, it does weaken armor. Yeah, it's in the area ammo armor. Right, get him stuck in there. Oh, you can revive um, squad and What's the squad members now by punching them in the chest. Okay, I'm going on foot. Shepard out. Garrus, take me to the last place you saw Victus. How far? Should be pretty quick, unless we find trouble. Yeah, that's better. Now it's installing it from the disk. It wasn't before? Apparently not, because I had Origin open. Damn it. So it just started downloading via Origin. Uh, now it's 9.6 megabytes a second, and going to take about 15 that's minutes. Yeah, that sounds much better. Still have family there? My dad. A sister. Three million lost the first day, five the second. 
How's your military holding up? Look around. That should give you some idea. You're putting up a good fight. For now. But how long does it take before the fight's kicked out? If they'd only listened to your warnings about the Reapers, you might have been ready. Where am I supposed to be going? I hate those things. And New York is crawling with the creepy bastards? Uh, I never should have left Earth. It's gonna be bad all over. Leaving the fight just pisses me off. But you're here asking victims to do the same thing. Leave the fight to make nice in some boardroom. This summit is the only chance we've got. I None can't believe they are... Alone. I can't believe they're freaking having a war summit because they can't agree to all fight at the same time. Really? Yeah. That's so dumb. Like, if they're all if they're all sieged, okay. I understand that, but... Come on. War summit because you don't want to help each other? No. Okay, good luck. Yes, sir. You know, Cerberus probably has a mind control ray by now. Yep. See, that's what I like about Cerberus. At least they get things done. Yeah. That's why I the left the that Alliance. They might be questionable, but they do them. Yeah, they do them fast. Not standing around here ignoring the Alliance's best soldiers' advice. So, Commander, you really think this summit will work? I mean, Asari? Salarians? Where's the Krogan and Batarians? Where's the meat? It's not that easy. The Batarians took the first hit when the Reapers arrived. Not much left of them. And the Krogan have never forgiven us for the genophage. Right. Turians sterilized them. Yeah. <laughs> I bet you wish the, the Krogans, Krogans were around now. So they won't be joining us. Too bad. I fought with the Krogan. They're tough sons of bitches. I like that they do acknowledge the whole Batarians are gone thing because where the Reapers were going to was Batarian space. Yeah. Well, that's why you blew up a Batarian system, because that's where the mass relay they were going to use was. I guess I did, but I have amnesia, so I don't remember it. Yeah. yeah. So that explains you know, why there's been enough time between arrival and now. Yeah, you know, they've yep. been busy wiping out the Batarians. <laughs> and also I have amnesia. Yes. Incendiary ammo is totally the best ammo. Yeah. I do miss having shockwave though. Move into the compound. Moving. Right behind you. Hmm. I want my biotic charge. Load you stupid game. I want to just go pew bam. I think you got all. You also got to download the from ashes too, right? Yeah, I'll still do all that. But my download speed shouldn't be that bad. Totally. Totally. It's gonna download from oh, Ashley, so I might leave the soundtrack for now. Not good, not good, not good. This rock will protect me. Oh, frick, he can jump over it! Oh, I'm so scared now. <laughs> he tricked me. Okay, this taller rock will protect me. <laughs> Boy, sure showed them. That, that thing's too easy to kill. It's more just stand back and shoot it. Yeah, unless it rushes you. So if it rushes you, oh, then you frick, run it's away. another one. Alright, Garrus, you got this. And they're dying. 
Are there two of them? Oh, there are two of them. Frickin' A. Okay, now it's gonna get harder. Where are all my guys? But they're an easy target. Looks grim. It's been a brutal fight for these guys. Yay, the rock saved me. So I'm guessing these are like Hust um Turians. Turian husks, yeah. yeah. Why are Turian husks so much smarter than human husks? I don't know. There's that guy. Finally. Pick up the Reaper Black Star. What? Where? I don't know. It was by that one you killed just before. Crap. I didn't even see it. Oh, here it is. It must be a heavy weapon. No, it's not. No, wait a minute. Why? How come it's not showing up? It's a heavy weapon. Interesting. Probably a one-shot heavy weapon. Boy, I hope this guy doesn't die in a cutscene. That would suck. General Victus. Yes. I'm Commander Shepard of the Normandy. Not Commander. I know who you are. I can't wait to find out what brings you out here. The Carrion. Where did you go? Heavy Reaper unit on the right flank. I believe your exact words were, get that thing the hell off my men. Appreciate it. General, you're needed off planet. I've come to get you. It will take something beyond important. At least Garrison's face is healing. My Turian brothers and sisters and their yeah, I haven't got a good look at their left side, his left side yet. You're the new Primarch. You're needed immediately to chair a summit and represent your people in the fight against the Reapers. That's literally one of the worst reasons to stop fighting a war. To stop fighting in a battle. We need to we need to form a committee. <laughs> yeah, we we need to really decide if we want to fight this war. Trade negotiations. negotiations. Turian hierarchy. <laughs> okay, for starters, yes. the Volus believe that the Salarians have been cutting too much in their the profits military. and <laughs> I'm no diplomat. I hate diplomats. What makes you think you're not qualified? I'm not really a by-the-book kind of guy, and I piss people off. My family's been military since the Unification War. War is my life. It's in my bones. But that kind of passion is... deceptive. It make you seem reckless when you're anything but. War is your resume. At a time like this, we need leaders who've been through that hell. I like that. You're right. And honestly? Uniting these races may take as much strength as facing the Reapers. See this devastation, Primarch? Double that for Earth. I need an alliance. I need the Turian fleet. Give me a moment to say goodbye to my men. Wait, what? Without him down here, there's a good chance we lose this move. Without him up there, there's a good chance we lose everything. Look at that. 
And they want my opinion on how to stop it? Failed CSEC officer, vigilante, and I'm their expert advisor? Think you can win this thing, Shepard? Yeah. Man, the Turians are Garrus. screwed if they're relying on Garrus. Sure I know! Shot. I'm damn sure nobody else can do it. For whatever it's worth, I'm with you. Welcome aboard. Huh. Are you ready, Primarch Victus? One thing. Commander, I appreciate your need for our fleets, but I can't spare them. Not while my world is burning. But if the pressure could be taken off Sullivan... What? That's a pretty tall order. We need the Krogan. I can't see us winning this thing without them. Get them to help us, and then we can help you. The Krogan. Hey, this entire thing's a giant like quest, got a lot but for money. races instead of individuals. Ah! What happened to Choice? Did she give me you a list? You must get the Krogan. And the Krogan would be like, no, we need a special, like, a sorry wine. Before, Commander Shepard. <laughs> but, Madam Counselor. Yes, we need to drink I before we go to battle. I things over with the Salarian Dalatras. To say she's upset would be a monumental understatement. Some of these issues are hundreds of years old. Time to let go. Sad to say, but any effort to ally these disparate groups seems doomed to failure. And I'm sure you understand that we cannot afford to waste time with the Reapers knocking at our door. You know what you just said was an oxymoron, right? Word. I'm sorry, but the Asari will not be at your summit. Our alliance would be stronger with the Krogan. You need them. We all do. I wish you luck, Commander. Goodbye. Of all the races that's against, like, uniting, on, the Asari. Yeah, because we all know that the Asari love uniting with anyone that walks past. Yeah. And doing them, too. <laughs> okay, I, I don't know. This Okay, I'm trying to make heads and tails of the story. So... At first, I thought it was just Earth that was being attacked, so I was like, okay, well, it's not, it's not kind of contrived, but whatever. But then, you know, I thought it was pretty cool that other people are getting attacked. But then, it's like, you're trying to get everyone to unite to defend Earth. Which I thought was justified, because no one else was getting attacked. They were all, like, kind of protecting their borders. No, now it seems but, very selfish. Yeah, That's now good. it seems really selfish, because, like... Their worlds are dying too. Like they're getting destroyed. There's reapers right there. They've probably been fighting them longer. And then, and the Earth fleet didn't go to help them. I don't know. It just seems weird. I thought they were just defending their borders, so it makes sense, right? You know what I'm saying? If you're yeah. if you're asking them to like to take a risk and withdraw, like and gather all the troops together to like clear Earth, and then when the rest of the reapers come, you like the whole fleet just kind of goes and clears system to system. Like that makes more oh. sense. That's that's what I thought was happening, but no, nope, they're all being attacked simultaneously. Yeah, they're all being attacked simultaneously. So now it's kind of like, well, why are you bothering with a war summit? Feels a little bit. Yeah, it does. Because it feels you very have selfish. To unite together and abandon everyone else to save one system, and that clearly should be Earth. Clearly. Oh my goodness. I, yeah, and then the reason they save Earth is because they build the stupid weapon at the end. Ah, oh, this is like Halo 3. Except, you know, in Halo 3 you had to go through a portal to activate the weapon. Here we're going to convince them all to save Earth, and then they're going to make the weapon just in time to destroy all the Reapers. But not any of the other races, because it would be a specialized energy weapon. Yeah. What the heck? What do you mean, offline? I don't know. She's not responding, and I can't access the AI core diagnostics. You better get down to deck three. Commander, comm systems are going haywire. Whatever's happening is centered on deck Oh, and now Edie's throwing a temper tantrum. Maybe you can get to Edie. Maybe Jack is crawling out of the wires. Yep, totally. She's like, Shepard, I've She's come like to join you. She's the entire time. Yeah. That would be incredible. Game of the century. Oh wait, no, it's not gonna be Edie. It's gonna be the stupid chick we put on board and then didn't like restrain. What chick? You remember the stupid chick we chased that looked like Miranda, but wasn't Miranda? All oh, right. Yeah, yeah, she was left in there alone, uh, and everyone was like, "What do we do?" Yeah. 
it feels like this game is only possible because everyone is doing the stupidest possible yep. things. That's a common thing. Yeah. Joke. What's that sound? Fire extinguishers, Commander. Could be an electrical fire or something. Or maybe a fire. I'm going fire. I think I think you should have a gun. Commander Shepard. Commander Shepard, why don't you listen to me? You should carry a gun. Edie, talk to me. I can't believe we left the stupid Cerberus agent in here. Is there a particular topic you wish to discuss, Shepard? What? What? <laughs> oh. Edie? Now Edie's going to be a new squad You're member. Dr. Great. Edie's body. The fuck? It was not a seamless transition. So Edie I nearly am. exploded in the process. I am. I am gobsmacked. Yeah, I wasn't expecting did that. This, did this? Did this just become a thing? The stupid ship AI is now in some. I don't even. I don't, I don't even know what to say. I, I, no, I don't the problem there. isn't that you left a Reaper agent so running amok. The problem is that I've even after the Alliance pulled the ship apart, they left the rogue AI unit running. Well, they thought it was a VI though, right? Yeah, I know. So this is all Joker's fault. Yeah. Oh my goodness! I understand it now. Joker's in love with Edie, and so Edie is now in a woman's body. <laughs> this is so <laughs> going to happen. Oh my goodness! It's all making sense. The only sense. woman who could ever love. This Joker is the only. Yeah, the only. It's the ship. out of metal. I can't believe this is going to be a thing. This is the only reason that this is possible. Edie. You need to alert us about incidents like this. You shouldn't have done this alone. You shouldn't have done this at all. You're a ship AI. Yeah, we, we already let you take full control of the ship. So if you're in there... So now we're letting you take full control of a Reaper human body thing. Or type wasn't this? Wasn't it also burnt? Take that body somewhere? Yeah, obviously Normandy's she cleaned it up. Is not suited to every combat In her brief moment of altercation. Excuse me, Shepard. I have to go visit Joker right now. This body could accompany you and to break every Normandy's bone in his body. Don't enter your bed chambers for approximately 5.7 hours. Before we do that. I need you to guarantee this mech doesn't have any more surprises in it. Is she really about to become a squad member? I don't know. Run whatever test you can. Then we can talk Shepard's taking this very nonchalantly. <laughs> he is. He's like, yep, ship AIs do this all the time. <laughs> totally. I didn't even think we had any ports in this place that lets you download yourself into a body. Just don't be surprised if the crew is a little wary of your new body. It was shooting at them a little while ago. An excellent point. I will take it to the bridge. Was shooting, shooting at them. I knew it! I freaking knew it! I knew it! On that, we can agree. She's doing it for Joker! Oh my god. I can't believe this. Okay, game just went back down. I don't know, the, the game has some parts which are really, really good. And it has parts from like... It doesn't feel like Mass Effect. And it has like... WTF moments like that. Yeah. Oh, you can reset everyone's powers. Yeah. Man. That's fantastic. Yeah. I'm so happy. Can All you right. do it whenever? Well, I suppose you I don't have resources need... now, so... I'm not too sure. Let's see. You just have to surgically remove their hands or something. Yep. Reassign power bonuses. Reassign powers. Oh, you can reassign your power bonuses. If you want. Yep, Edie's a squad member. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I can't <laughs> oh believe... God. Yeah, that's... Oh, It feels so on wrong! The plus side, on the plus side, you don't have to put up with Ashley now. 
I don't I don't think it's a plus, she was gonna stay in the Citadel anyways. How did this even become a thing in like Bioware's like meetings? How did this even come up? It came were they, up. Were they just like the you know EA replaced everyone. Yeah. They're just assuming direct control. Yeah. They're probably like, well listen, Mass Effect three, we want the, we want to go out big. We need to get some it's new squad members. Horrible. We're gonna we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have Edie. Everyone liked Edie. Let's make her a squad member for no apparent reason. Um, you know we don't have any Volus on the team yet. Got to get a Volus. Get some get some John Reese Davies to uh, voice the Volus. That would actually be we're, pretty. We're gonna get a we're gonna get a new um, Elcor member. Got to get them all on there. Elcor. You can ride them around. And a Hanar. We'll get a Hanar member. Gosh. I would love. A Volus voice by John Reese Davies. I would too. That would be the best squad member ever. Uh, it's I don't know. It's so weird. It's kind of like Edie should stay on the ship. She shouldn't be able to. It feels really contrived. It's like Cortana all of a sudden getting like a a human body. Where is Edie anyways? Oh, let's talk to Joker. Hey, Commander. Check out my co pilot! Oh, that's where she is. Shepard just stares. Joker is he so is, happy about this. He he has lost control of everything on this ship. <laughs> like <laughs> he he's just thinking about his life and where things went wrong. <laughs> it's like, well I probably shouldn't have come back to life. That's probably where it started. So she installed herself into the new body. This is all my fault. Yeah. Come on, Commander. Don't you trust me? Okay, let me put it this way. If I knew that Edie was going to install herself into a sexy robot body, no, do you honestly think Joker. I'd be able to keep quiet? Friggin' about? knew it. Look at that. Friggin' knew it was Joker. I would have baked a cake. I am right here, Jack. Yes, you are, Edie. Oh my god. Yes, you are. That is. That's just that is wrong on so many levels and layers that I can't even. I... But we all knew that the only woman for Joker was going to have to be the ship. Yeah, but what made you it? You were hoping she'd remain a ship. Yeah, I was like, yeah. oh, you know, you know, she hated the AI, and so he no, was like, well, we clearly need her to be Cortana. Oh my. Oh. I don't even know what to say. I'm just so flabbergasted that this is actually a thing. That oh, I can't fall. what the frick? So was yours stuck at ninety nine percent or not? Um, uh, it took a bit to validate, I think. Uh, okay. Hello, Shepard. Still getting used to greeting people in person? No, I require only one occurrence to adapt to a new concept. How are you adjusting to the arms and legs? I am interested to see how this body performs under real combat conditions. If I could accompany you sometime. Okay, it's all good now. Without stress testing, there is no way of knowing if it has serious design oversights. Oh, At the it's moment, updating. it appears adequate. That's not the word I'd use to describe you. Perhaps we should speak privately. Perhaps you should have realized Joker's a bit of a creep before you downloaded yourself into here. a female body, Edie. She didn't have a choice in the matter. Does Joker not like your new platform? No, he approves. He wants me on the bridge. He says having me within visual range is important to his morale. Shepard, do you believe your crew members should be allowed to disobey an order on moral grounds? Um, I think I need a little more context, Edie. Yeah, but she's not going to give are, context. Are we talking like sabotaging the mission for love? Because <laughs> that would be a very serious breach of... In fact, no one is allowed to love on this ship except the commander. Except yeah. That's, uh, that's a... That's a rule. That I just... That is, that's on the forefront right now. Absolutely. I have no use for team Stupid members who can't think for themselves. Priority for download Why are you wasn't going to be the like soundtrack. That? It was going to be Cerberus. everything but the soundtrack. I do not take moral stances that conflict with orders from my executive officers. But when Jeff removed my AI shackles, 
I became capable of self-modifying my core programming. Yeah, she became Cortana. I asked him if he thought I should change anything now that I can. He deflected the question with humor. And you didn't get an answer. Correct. He has repeated this pattern in response to several of my inquiries. <clears throat> Do you think I should make modifications? I'm still not sure what she's asking. Is she asking if she can learn? She's asking, yeah, basically, if she's allowed to change her programming. Human Shepherd, can, can you that. tell me this thing and this feeling called love? What is this guy? <laughs> uh, Only you can really answer that question. That's the point of free will. But moral decisions should not be made in a vacuum. If I do not ask the crew for their opinion, I could miss crucial context. You know what's the saddest May thing? May I ask you the questions, Jeff Avoy? Edie, Edie's model has the best lip syncing out of any of the characters. Know, right? Yeah. Very well. I will Everyone else's point. lip sync is pretty awful. Everyone else is like a hand Edie's puppet. Like crisp yeah. Perfect. Everyone else is a hand puppet and Edie's like LA Noir here. Even better. It's totally because she is a robot and robots are perfectionists. You you crazy humans and your lip syncing issues. Yeah. Commander, yeah. you have Vastly a message from Commander Williams. She must be feeling better. Oh, this day just can't get any worse. First Edie's downloaded into a, he a body oh and now God Ashley's better. Ashley. Uh, okay, let's let's end the second part here because I don't know. I don't even know what to think anymore. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm going to need some time to process this. Oh, gosh. What the hell?